Hi everyone and welcome to the show, welcome back to Final Fantasy V Blind. Um, before we get started, there is something very important I need to quickly mention and I'll try and keep this quick. So, due to the way that the sort of file of Final Fantasy V works and the way I've saved and loaded it, I've saved myself in a state where, right here, this is where I've saved, and this is the only place I can load from. Just the way I've been doing it. Basically, this means if I cannot win this fight, I will have to restart the whole game again until I get back up to this point and continue the LP. That could be a bot. A, that could mean that it would take some time for the next episode to come out, and it does mean that I would be able to like I would have some some knowledge, so I'd be better prepared, and that might ruin the LP a wee bit. Um, to avoid this, I've been practicing this battle from this point onward. Uh, just this battle. I haven't won it yet. But I've gone close and I've learned a few wee things about this fight um, that will help me, I think. First of all, yes, it actually turns out I have Phoenix Downs. The second thing, these things can't use Raze forever. They eventually run out of MP and if they try to use Raze with no MP, they just kill themselves. That's the only important information, um, so I'm going to continue now. Also, there may not be so much commentary during the battle because I'm going to try and focus for this one. So yeah. Anyway, let's get along with this. Yeah, let's see if Iris might be better to revive. See, I'm still going to try and do some commentary, right? Let us... Wait, did I go past the thing? Yeah, it was... I guess, uh... I'm just reviving people, so I guess I can keep my commentary up now, right? So... Uh, Bart's is Bart's fault, shouldn't he be... Uh, attacking? I don't need to worry too much about HP since they just one-hit kill us anyway with their self-destruct. Um. I'm actually not so sure, right? Uh, let's just go f for attacking this top one. Oh, well, that's fire is dead. Lena's almost dead. So they can do their normal, uh, like a normal attack, which means I do have to keep health fairly high. Oh, oh no, this is bad. Okay, as long as I have two people alive, uh, things are good. Oh, good, use that online or that. That's quite good. If I'm pretty sure Faris ha Oh, no. Okay, time to uh, retry. Okay, sorry for what must seem like an awkward cut. I'm not just going to show uh, endless repeats. So, situation here, as you can probably see, we've got. A two and two match here, sort of, um, Bart's and Farris, and we've got two Pro Bowlers left, uh, we might get to end this fight. Things are going fairly well. This attempt is going much better. But actually... Item... Phoenix down... Farris might... I, I, I don't know. I think Robin and Farris is just a good idea. I mean, Bars and Fires are my two best damage dealers. You know, when I just have haste. Uh, just a quick cure to make sure nobody gets knocked out by any normal attacks. That should do good. Um, let's try actually. See if we can fight. Oh, wait. Right. He, they're not dead. So let's try and damage this one because it's the idea is once you take once there's one left you have to take it really quickly because they take a while to do rays sometimes um, sometimes they will use rays when there's more than just one left so I'm trying to take them out really quickly ah okay never mind um, from what I remember from my practices the two at the front don't have a lot of MP. 
Uh, they probably used it up earlier in the last episode or something, I don't know. Um, but they run out, they tend to be the ones who run out of MP the fastest. Also, I should probably revival in at some point, she could uh, help. Okay, how many four phoenix stones left? It's really, I mean the way this is going to turn out, I think it's just going to turn into a stolen match more than anything. Oh, of course, kill the person who's busy healing. Oh right, I thought it was another self-destruct. Oh, I was not looking forward to that. Let's just revive Elena. Let, let's see what happens when we revive Elena instead. Oh. Now let's go back to reviving Faris. Oh, so I'm running out of Phoenix down, so I'm going to have to try to end this fight quickly. I'm fighting for the LP. Oh, what you missed! See, I don't Right, I hope. Oh, he's gonna blow you now. It was not a good idea, right? Throw Mithra knife. <laughs> oh yes! Right, so that one's out of MP, at least I know that. Uh, let's go for attacking some at the back, because I know they probably that throw through actually I did a lot more than I was expecting. Nine hundred and sixty, that's uh, that's a good amount. Cause I don't think they have a lot of health the the put over No, throw. Uh let's throw a mage marsh. Oh didn't mean to fling him. Ah he's dead. Oh, nobody better do a self-destruct. Ah, oh, last phoenix down. This is not looking good. Oh, I'm not flinging at him, I know he's got, uh, not got the MP for thing in. Now, why am I attacking him? Because I'm pretty sure he's low on MP for a rise. Wait, why am I thinking about a rise? Oh, jeez. This is a pretty serious fight, and if I can't win this fight at all, then... Oh no! I was gonna. Eat. Uh, I don't have anything else. Oh, good for you, bots defending. That'll keep you alive. But let's just start and see if I can like outlast them. Nope. Ah, oh, that was a difficult battle. Now, I'm not going to continue this episode because I think I've taken up too much time. I'm going to um, talk about my strategy that I used and it took a long while. Faris and Lena still had mage mashers on them. Basically what I did, um, 
I attacked accidentally with Faris and I silenced one of the bombs because Mage Masher inflicts silence. With the silence cast, the bombs are unable to use Arise. So I went around and silenced all the bombs and they were either... So basically every Puro Bolas was either silenced or they didn't have enough MP and then I went around killing them off one by one. Sorry I didn't show that strategy. Um, so thank you for watching. Hurry, the LP is safe. And... Next time we'll actually continue and make progress. Sorry this wasn't a very progressy episode. But I guess we could watch this one we kinda cut scenish bit. Oh it was awesome, yeah. Take a look at this map. Guess we gotta go with all those points we're meeting. I get over there. Now, let's see, where was that walk? Ha, <laughs> even shows it on the map so we don't forget. I'll head a bit closer to it, but I don't want to get too close. Because I want to save the warping to next time. Oh great, here comes the slow-mo. Hey, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you for watching, and then next time we'll be warping to Galf's world, and it's sure to be good.